Hello again and welcome back to Silent Hill. So in our last video we've discovered that Dr. Kaufman is working with Dahlia in one of her patients. I don't know who it is but as well as meeting up with Lisa again who happens to be a memory of apparition of some sort. We've never heard from her again. Not to mention we've met up with Alyssa's memory. So yeah, we still haven't find Cheryl, so I'm pretty sure this may be the final video to save her. So with that said, let's get into this once and for all. I also forgot to point out that they've mentioned something about the demon. So if that's the case, I'm pretty sure we can defeat this demon and save Cheryl if she's around. So let's go behind this door and not waste any time. Come, come along. No. No. I don't want to. Do what mommy tells you now. I just want you to lend me a teeny bit of your power. That's all. No. I don't want to do it. It will make everyone happy, and it's for your own good, too. Oh, but Mommy, I just want to be with you. Just two of us. Please understand. Oh, yes, I see. Maybe Mommy has been wrong. Mommy! Why didn't I see this before? There's no reason to wait. Herein lies the mother's womb, containing the power to create life. I could have done it all myself. Mommy? So basically she's using Alyssa's power to create something. And fortunately I can't go into these doors. So the only place left is downstairs. Hold on for a second. That's the only door, okay, so. Enough running our mouth, it's time to go see what's beneath those stairs. I was shocked to realize the talisman of Metrotron was being used. In spite of the lost soul returning at last. Just a little longer and all would have been for naught. It's all because of that man. We must be thankful to him. Even though Alessa has been stopped, his little girl has to go. What a pity. <laughs> Where's Cheryl? What have you done to her? What are you talking about? You've seen her many times, restored to her former self. I'm in no mood for jokes. Don't you see? She's right there. That's absurd. You are the only one. Who thinks so? Why? Why are you doing this? 
It's been a long seven years. For the seven years since that terrible day, Alessa has been kept alive, suffering a fate worse than death. Alessa has been trapped in an endless nightmare from which she never awakens. He has been nurtured by that nightmare, waiting for the day to be born. That day has finally come. The time is nigh. Everyone will be released from pain and suffering. Our salvation is at hand. This is the day of reckoning. When all our sorrows will be washed away. When we return to the true paradise. My daughter will be the mother of God. how they were before. Kaufman! Did I ask for this? Nobody uses me. You won't get away with this. Your work is over. We don't need you anymore. What do you think you could accomplish by coming here? My, aren't we getting cocky? Bet you can't see this. The glove it is! I thought I got rid of that! All I had to do was plant it somewhere to be fine. You all well, it kept you busy. Ha! You're easy. And there's more where this came from. Stop it! What the? It looks like we have the final boss, Samael herself. For itself. And that is a hideous looking appearance. And she is dead. So now we're gonna have to fight this beast. And I cannot get over the sound the song for the boss fight so basically he's one of the fu the hardest enemy so you're gonna have to shoot him the best you can without getting killed because she will use the lightning on you so go in a far away distance away from her to shoot her in that distance now quickly put on this and you see how many damage you get so try taking that out. 
keep shooting her until he's dead. It's kind of simple, but be careful. Well, you see that? Keep shooting. And I cannot hear the rifle. Oh, that was a close one. Almost out of my rifle rounds. And I can't... Oh, there you go. It's already dead. So just like that, try shooting him the rifle as much as you can without getting hit in right timing, and it's simple. So unfortunately we couldn't find Cheryl. This thing happens to be Cheryl. Let's just watch and see what's going on. This is my daughter, the actual Cheryl, or a different baby. Yeah, what is it? You're showing me the way to salvation. I couldn't find Cheryl, but I guess this baby represents the reincarnation or rebirth of Cheryl. So now Sybil has to follow me too. Pick up the pace. And what about you, Kaufman? Were you any help? And there is Lisa again. Bye-bye, Kaufman. We'll miss you. So we're running for our lives before this whole place collapse. Fortunately, everything is frozen, just to give us enough time to make it safely. And we made it out alive, so now let's get out of the town never to return again.
And there you have it. That was Silent Hill. So this is the second best survival horror to rival Resident Evil, like I said in my first video. The difference is it has more atmosphere and more focus more on open world and it's capable of giving you all the item rooms as you want. And who would have thought that Alessa and Cheryl is the same person at the end. But I'm pretty sure the rest of the sequel, one, two, three, and whatever, would be more superior and more scary. But that's it for another time. So thank you for watching this. And if there's anything that you like, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. So until then, I will see you again in the next project. And have a very happy Halloween.